the Magpie! In this video, we're gonna play around with this one. This is a 3D printed synthesizer from Oskitone uh, <laughs> with a twist. It's actually something that I sort of commissioned uh, before I went into hiatus. So, <laughs> bad friend. But before I start making music with it, I wanna cut back to like a month, two months ago when I showed this off to the drunk neighbor and Bathmaster Andreas. We're gonna cut to that now. While I'll start to make st uh, drums or something. So enjoy. Silent treatment? What? Oh, is that, uh? Yes or no? Oh. <laughs> what silent treatment? Yes. <laughs> silent treatment on you. You are silent and we will treat you. Okay. Hi, Magby! I'm here with Bass Master and, yes. yes. and, and the, the drunk, drunk neighbor. neighbor. Always on my mind, never in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> we are not gonna make a bass video, even though Bassmaster Andreas is here. We actually, we aren't really sure what we're gonna do in this video, but I, I know for a fact what this does. Okay. It's from Oskitone. You, you get it as a kit, so you get to build it yourself. Uh -huh. Which yeah. is pretty fun. That's yeah. pretty cool. It's also, it's a very good kit for beginners. Like if you wanna, if you feel like soldering one. <laughs> are you nervous that someone's gonna break the window? No. I'm not. I'm nervous that you're gonna break the window now. <laughs> we, I guess. we should have like curtains and you can <laughs> open, <laughs> open the window. Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <That's> <laughs> <the window. laughs> Do some No, but okay, so um, I, I want to continue explaining a tiny bit, which is that is, since it's got all of these sections, you can see that it, it sort of looks the same over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. Like I'm, I'm telling you now as well as the audience. <laughs> like every blue, white, Thing, or every, every ship mm. is dedicated to one of the keys. Oh, okay, so it's like that many oscillators. We're gonna try it immediately. Okay, okay. Uh, but I'm still gonna explain <laughs> more. <laughs> no, but okay, you you try it and you we get live reaction, okay? Uh, okay, let's turn it on. Oh, yeah, no. It's backwards. Oh, let's get scary. Is it weird to play uh, when it's backwards? Oh yeah, it's showed like it showed like super. <laughs> Good showing. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, it's it's backwards. So since and that was what I was gonna get to that since you have all of these different blocks, each each key has a. a a block individually, you tune it yourself. So it's oh, okay. possible to That's... tune it however you want. Like you don't have to tune it backwards, oh, but okay. I tuned it backwards. But, uh, <coughs> so annoying. Is that the final conclusion? <laughs> <laughs> but it's cool, it's cool. End of video. So Oskiton was nice enough to write <clears throat> out all the keys. So even though, because it, it's mirrored, so it looks identical, like the keyboard, if you look at this keyboard, for example, even though this keyboard is fucked up, <laughs> it, it's still mirrored. Yeah, yeah, it so is. So it looks it entirely the same. So he wrote out to be nice, so I knew how to tune it. And there, there's a lot of like music theory type phenomenons. For example, if you take a, a C major, like how you would take a C major, tiny bit out of tune because uh -huh. I tuned it. Oh, uh, exactly. So it's A minor. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's the, the polar opposite. So C major and A minor, uh -huh. those are the... If you take, like, how do you play the four chords? Do you know the four chords? What's, what uh, is that famous song? Yeah, like Let It Be. Speaking oh. words of wisdom, let it be. You can tune it so they're at least sounding not oh, yeah. completely out of tune. But they're gonna sound awful anyways. Now we break the window, I see. <laughs> like you said. Hey, then, bro. Messed up. Nearly done. Whoops. Nej. 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 Nej.
I can't see. But what I'm wondering is, yeah, yeah, so like, do you get it in your in your head that you're supposed to go, okay, higher notes? That, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wrong yeah, direction. Yeah, yeah. So you get that pretty fast? Yeah, 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 I think so. Do you want snooze? Why? Uh, because I'm gonna take one. Nice. <laughs> Why is it so short? So couldn't you play it upside down then? Yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. tried. Do you want to try it again? Yeah, I think it's gonna be, it, it's gonna be pretty much like normal. That came, that was sort of weird, uh, that's what you did. What I'm interested in is, like the essence of what we're doing right here is, is it inspiring to have a keyboard that is reversed? Like will it make oh, you, yeah, yeah. when you're producing music or whatever, play differently I than you were yeah, to play? Yeah, I think so, yeah, yeah. it's like, uh, there, there's a guy, um, He's dead now. Savi Null, uh, 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 keyboard player, and he sometimes to gigs uh, switched uh, sw you oh, yeah, switch the switcheroo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you can see some clips when you see his hand, but it goes like he plays the melody and it goes in the wrong direction. What? Oh shit! So he was like to open up uh, ideas. He played both. Shit! <laughs> <laughs> but it's. Uh... Funny enough, it's very easy to do this with a toy piano, I think. I haven't actually tried it, but that I think it's really easy. So if we get that out, I enjoy it. Oh, but then just... Exactly, yeah. you just turn it. it. It's supposed to, you just turn it around. So this one goes down like this, you turn it around. You play a natural melody in reverse right now. Like what melody? Are you playing yeah. an actual melody in the reverse? So how do you play that uh, piece of musical? It's a very existential art. hard question. <laughs> Not to answer it. Reverse. I'm just playing it. So are we done? We can be done now and I'm gonna cut to doing something. Commercial. Okay, nice. Nice, guys. Here we go. Drive hey. safely and don't do anything I don't do would do. <laughs> Welcome back! Quick recap, I guess. This, the Oskitone Poly 555, you are able to tune it however you want, and I commissioned that I would get it labeled backward. So now it's tuned, since you tune each of these individually, it's tuned reverse, which is very fun and confusing at the same time. Those two, they, they, they mingle perfectly, right? Fun and confusing. Completely pulling you out of your comfort zone whilst Letting you be a hundred percent in your comfort, like in your comfort zone with what you do with your fingers, but what that corresponds to in what you hear is far out, man. I, however, feel like what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna, I don't know, I'm just gonna base base it on if if I think it sounds nice. I'm just gonna take a couple of chords to the drums that I made that you heard really fast. <laughs> That sound is amazing. The <laughs> exploding sound. But I want that. Super dry, uh, but since this is what we have, we only have, there's no fancy stuff, I guess is what I'm saying. Uh, <laughs> but we have a lot of VSTs, so I can do a lot with, with VSTs, but I'm gonna try to do bass, so I'm gonna play through this one, Fruits, Magpie Pedals, 
my very own. Okay, I, I, as you can hear, made some f funky shit with the bass because I feel like we need to <laughs> distinct different sounds from each other. Uh, not only notes. Okay, so I am now gonna quickly come up with lyrics and melody and sing that and I have an idea actually because I recorded some piano and then I reversed it. So I'm just gonna sing this, whatever it is that I'm gonna sing, and then I'm gonna chop up the vocals every fourth, every eighth, and reverse each and every single one of those segments so you're not gonna hear what I sing. So it doesn't really matter what I sing. Still, let's come up with something really good to say.